Marco's double standards exposed after paparazzi revelations. She ghosted me. Meghan Markle allegedly ghosted her father after he posed for paparazzi photographs before her royal wedding in 2018. But a deep book has revealed Meghan herself staged paparazzi photo shoots to raise her profile three years earlier. Meghan's father, Thomas Markle, admitted he staged photographs of him running up a hill, lifting weights, getting measured for a wedding suit, and reading a book titled Images of Britain in a coffee shop. Mr. Marco believes it was these pictures, along with various media interviews, that created the rift between father and daughter that ended up with her cutting him out of her life completely. He admitted it was a stupid mistake, but insisted that Megan ignoring him is a punishment which does not fit the crime. Mr. Markle told ITV's Good Morning Britain, I realized it was a serious mistake, but it was hard to take it back. I had been seen as a negative for an entire year, and I wanted to improve my look. Mr. Markle was unable to attend the wedding due to suffering a heart attack just days before the big day, but heartbreakingly, he has not seen Megan since. He claimed to text me to texted Megan every day after the wedding and got no response. Mr. Markle told the Daily Mail in 2018, I apologized to Harry on the phone and all he said was, if you'd listen to me, none of this would have happened. I did a few things wrong and said a few things I should not have said. But some of the royals have done far worse things. These are, there are convicts in prisons who have murdered and committed all kinds of horrible crimes and their daughters still visit them. In a bizarre twist, a new book about Meghan and Harry has claimed that the Duchess herself used to organize the paparazzi to take pictures of her to promote her image when she was an actress in Toronto. At the time, Meghan was a relatively unknown actress playing paralegal Rachel Zane on the TV legal drama suits. Megan allegedly told photographers where she would be so they could get pictures and left info slip out to the press. The book entitled Fighting Freedom, Harry and Megan and the Making of a Modern Royal Family by Omid Scobby and Caroline Durand will be released in a couple of weeks. Now, a source has told the son that Megan set up paparazzi shots through her PR team in March 2015 when she was in London to raise her profile in the UK. Megan and her agent reportedly arranged for the photographs to be taken as she walked into a London restaurant about a year before she met Prince Harry. A photographer snapped pictures of Megan as she headed into Toto's restaurant in Kensington wearing a stylish black outfit with a white sleeveless trend coat paired with dark sunglasses. Inside the restaurant, Megan was interviewed by the Mail on Sunday's U magazine as part of a weekly feature showcasing up-and-coming talent. The insider claimed Megan knew the photographer was going to be at the Kensington restaurant to take her photos. Megan's former agent, Gina Nerthorpe Crown, at a Crozier Crown agent, denied that the pictures of Toto's at Toto's had been prearranged through the firm. She said, It is absolutely not true. I am not aware of any setup pictures being done with Megan. Nevertheless, celebrity photographer George Pimentel who became close to Megan while she lived in Canada, said she tried to promote herself in any way she could from the start.